Hi guys, I hope that you're very well. It's Silvana here and I am back for a new video on the Jews and Gems YouTube channel. Thank you so much for joining me today. Today we will be talking about yet another crystal, but not any crystal, a crystal that is uh, again particularly dear to me because it's something that I very much need on a daily basis uh, due to its wonderful and beautiful healing properties and everything it stands for and that beautiful crystal happens to be dalmatian jasper yes you heard that right dalmatian jasper dalmatian like the dog <laughs> same name because you're going to notice that it actually looks it's quite reminiscent of the dalmatian jasper it looks very much so uh, it reminds you of the dog basically just by looking at it you know which i think is a wonderful choice of a name and you're going to see that everything we're going to talk about today you know, you can see like, yeah, the name may make sense. You're going to see as we go along. So we're going to discuss everything there is for you guys to know about what does it mean? What are the properties associated with it? The way you can use it, uh, as well as, of course, everything related to the chakras and the zodiac signs associated with this beautiful stone. We're going to cover everything. So let's just get started. Um, I'm going to show you some uh, some of my own here. I have two pieces that these are actually my own <laughs> that I personally work with. So I like as well also to show you guys what I like to work with just to give you a bit of an idea. So first, here is my beautiful bracelet. I absolutely love my uh, Dalmatian Jasper bracelet. You can find it as well on the website if anyone is wondering of course it's on jewelsandgems.shop there should be a link in the des uh, description of this video it should be there <laughs> otherwise you can just google it i'm sure you, you'll find it easily and um that's the bracelet first of all and then what i also love to work with it's my huge um kind of you could call it a smooth stone because you can see it's very flat but it's quite wide so some people like it a, to call it a smooth stone some people like to call this format um, a worry stone you have different names but for me it's just yeah i love i love to have it with me it's and it's easy it's so nice because some of those shapes they can go easily in your pocket you know it's discreet it doesn't look like there's anything there you know because it's quite flat which is wonderful so as we were saying as the name suggests um this makes Dalmatian Jasper, a f wonderful crystal companion for anyone, you know. And what I love the most about it is that whenever you're feeling a bit down or under the weather, uh, in terms of, you know, your energy field or, you know, just in general, you know, whenever you feel under the weather, it's excellent to work with Dalmatian Jasper because it's going to really help to uplift you and, you know, uh, lift your spirit and really bring in a lot of happy, positive, uh, abundant energy. And uh, it really is a great stone for anyone that's easily stuck in a rut and that finds it very hard to get out of their way, get out of that comfort zone and go against the flow. Because sometimes, as, as good as it is to go with the flow, sometimes you need to be a little bit of a disruptor. You know what I mean? You need to, you know, really channel that energy of, you know, going out of your comfort zone, embracing that inner uh, inner fire, inner playfulness, inner power that you have within yourself. And, um, you know, which is something, for example, that for a lot of us comes more naturally, maybe as we are younger and as we grow, grow up and become adults, it's something that starts to get lost, unfortunately. So it really brings you back to that inner child and everything that's good and positive about that, about your inner child. And, um, you know, overall, it can only be positive for your overall uh, well-being and state of mind. You know, so very much so you can see there is an energy here of uh, almost like you could say of, you know, of the actual dog you know as a pet what does it what does it represent as an animal you know all the values that go with it you know our relationship with with the you know with the dogs and especially if you are guys uh, dog owners pet owners yourself you know like 
what type of energy they, they, they make us feel and you know how they can uplift us very easily just by being their playful selves you know uh, so it's kind of reminiscent of that a little bit that that's what I like about it too um, overall apart from that it's also great for determination uh, strength grounding uh, which obviously is going to make it a great crystal for the root chakra so you know uh, very much so about that grounding that sense of protection stability but at the same time uh, it's also about encouraging that uh, you know that idea of playfulness and just going getting out of the, of the rut and uh, it's very good if you're someone for example we're going to talk about the zodiac signs after but i'm sure you can already guess who all this uh, suits very well uh, especially if you're familiar with your astrology you like everyone that's kind of analytical so i'm going to give myself as an example here as a true virgo sun <laughs> i tend to be very analytical i'm very grounded that way and sometimes you know i need a little bit of that uh, energy from uh, dalmatian jasper to really i suppose remind me of of the the, the joy of simply being and uh, of coming back to the present moment and being more mindful in my life and uh, you know especially i like to recommend it for people that um you know lose sense of joy of life and they forget to be grateful to enjoy life and uh, and you know forget that sense of living in the present moment well dalmatian jasper is great especially as a bracelet because it's all about a re reawakening recalling boosting promoting that sense of fun of joy of being here of joy of living of reminding you basically that you know you're not here just to be complaining and dwelling all the time uh, you are here as well to have some fun and just you know like enjoy yourself too you know that's also part of life otherwise life would be you know very very miserable you know for all of us so it's not that's not that's not worth it that's not what we want so you know what we want is to be emotionally balanced uh we want to be in complete harmony with our emotions with our feelings and uh you know completely uh, i suppose forgetting and moving away from anything that would be like negative you know like negativity bad bad emotions uh, stress, anxiety, skepticism, uh, disillusion, cynicism, and the list goes on and on. And, uh, you know, and that's why, um, that's why Dalmatian Jasper is great. And for anyone that's wondering, actually, the black dots uh, of the uh, Dalmatian Jasper happen to be some type of black tourmaline. So you can see why also it's very grounding. Because of those inclusions of black tourmaline, it's going to be a great gemstone to really help with uh, eliminating that negativity and those negative energies we've just mentioned and talked about and that will allow you to move forward into your life and then be more in a state of joy and just enjoyment you know you can see there that these elements just um, work together in a lovely way so yeah dalmatian jasper is so nice so great crystal for anyone that's into um personal development even though sometimes I think personal development is a little bit overrated, let me let me explain. I think that before even thinking of personal development, the first thing we should all think about is healing. Because in order to develop yourself personally, before developing yourself, you have to make sure that you are that your foundations are good. And to do that, you need to make sure that you have healed from any type of past potential trauma. So that's the first step. So before even contemplating working with Dalmatian Jasper for your personal development and manifesting your dream and goals, because that's what it can help with, I would first recommend you guys, that's just a little side note, um, just to remind yourself of the importance of actually doing the healing work first and then moving on to that, uh, to make sure you make the most out of it all. And uh, yeah, great for general positivity and joy. This is definitely, um, you can't go wrong you know and um that sense as well of um like um how can i explain strengthening bonds as well comes with it so definitely great for long lasting relationships great for uh family relationships uh you know 
teamwork, cooperation, everything related to working with other people in the best way possible, instilling beautiful, peaceful and positive energy, you know, in those areas. You know, definitely is another great use for the beautiful Dalmatian Jasper. And what I would also add to that is that it's great, as we said earlier, for determination. That was one of the first keywords we mentioned at the very beginning of, of the video. And why is that? Because it's really going to help you to um, any ideas, concepts, thoughts that you may have to make them happen and to, uh, you know, at the same time, make make you feel supported through that journey of making those ideas happen so very much you can see that very strong uh, lower chakra energy very masculine type of energy which of course resonates with who aries of course this is a great crystal for any areas out there because for any because you guys you are the initiators of the zodiac you guys absolutely need to be on top of your game all the time and of course it's very normal for all of us you guys included my aries friends sometimes you may feel a bit of a, of a dip and you feel a little bit difficult you know, like life is difficult or you feel like certain things uh, are harder than usual or you get stuck in a rut or sometimes you overwork so much than that uh, you tire yourself out and you just need to get back to that boost definitely consider some dimension jasper to get keep you on track to make sure you keep doing your magic because that's what you are doing guys you know and uh yeah definitely i would say anyone that this resonates with definitely get your hands on uh, dalmatian jasper for people for example let's say if they just to clarify because you might think for people what is she on about for people i would recommend usually bracelets in the sense that for us it's it's the best thing we can do is to wear this type of of crystals all the time with us now it's definitely a great crystal to to have for your pets because i get this question all the time so i might as well throw in this here if you have a pet and this energy resonates with you right now and you feel it suits your pet definitely get your hands on some lovely uh, dalmatian jasper you should and on top of that uh, it's also great for in terms of feng shui if you guys are into that i'm just going to throw in this real quick definitely keep it keep it in in a space in your home if you have some a space that involves several people for example if you have a family try to keep it somewhere where there's a lot of family members where you tend to spend most of your time uh, to encourage that sense of connection and loyalty between one another and good relationships and happiness uh, or if you are living on your own, you can also keep it in a space where you spend a lot of time, for example, your living room, your living space, just to instill a little bit of that happiness and joy, even though you're on your own, just to keep that going, basically. So that would be it. Apart from that, we said areas, but there's also uh, two more signs that I think would benefit greatly. You can guess the second one already after what I've just said earlier. Uh, we have... Virgo, so Aries, Virgo, and Gemini. So these three signs would definitely benefit the most out of uh, Dalmatian Jasper's energy. But if you don't have any of those in your birth chart, that is okay. That's absolutely fine, you know. And it doesn't always have to be just your sun sign, just to be clear. It works with your moon sign, your rising sign. These are also extremely important to keep in mind. So definitely check out those and see how that resonates with you. And uh, yeah, you know, if you tend to work with, um, obviously, you know, mantras, affirmations, intentions, if you love meditating, like me, <laughs> then definitely uh, a, great, a great affirmation or mantra that I would recommend while you're working with uh, Dalmatian Jasper would be something like, uh, I embrace positivity and playfulness. I value my true, loyal, and faithful relationships. That, in a nutshell, is the energy of Dalmatian Jasper. So definitely, yeah, that would be it. I think we've covered pretty much everything. Uh, so yeah, let me know, guys, how does this resonate with you? What do you guys think about the beautiful Dalmatian Jasper? Is it a stone that you already have? 
in your uh, jewelry collection or not you know is it on your wish list let me know i would love to hear from you and uh, please make sure you give this video a big thumbs up that would be amazing and um, again thank you so much i hope you have all a beautiful day and i will be talking to you soon thank you so much guys